budget is knocking on the doors. Through 10 different characters, we have already depicted the dreams of crows of Indians. Now is the turn of our 11th dream. It is in the minds of every citizen. Such an expectation that everybody wants this time from the budget. So, let's start today's story. On the night of December 20, when we were shivering from the cold waves of the winter, Shivkesh, a citizen of Berej district of Uttar Pradesh, had gone to a shop to buy a heater for his family, but he was left shocked by its high price. Prices of heaters have skyrocketed by 20% in the last one year. Shivkesh had planned to buy an electric heater because he thought that a gas heater would anyway be expensive because of the ever-increasing prices of the LPG cylinders. Well, it is said that the numbers don't really depict the pain behind the story as these are cold. Maybe this is why, according to the latest statistics released by the government, the inflation has only increased by 6% in the last one year. But in reality, the prices of items used in daily life such as soaps, oil, medicines, electricity and telephone bills have increased manifold. Inflation is hurting so much that it has become impossible to meet the financial needs by the salary that one gets. Majority of the employers have not given any salary hikes for the last two years owing to the economic disruptions caused by the pandemic. People are left with no other option than to cut on daily consumption habits. This is the reason why Shiv Kesh got rid of the maid Vimala during the lockdown and has not called her back yet. This shows how the fall in consumption of people like Shiv Kesh affects those who are at the bottom of the pyramid. Before COVID-19 gripped the economy, people like Vimla who travelled from villages to the towns in search of livelihood used to collectively send rupees 4 lakh crore back home. This comprised 2% of the country's GDP. But this is only one side of the problem. On the other side, the people who returned to the villages have increased the problem of unemployment in the hinterland. NG and Rega figures bear evidence to this fact. So, inflation is such a problem that has gripped everybody. Money9 has found in its Just a Dream series that the rise in inflation has affected everybody both directly and indirectly. Ravi Prakash is worried about the expensive insurance premiums. Sujit is apprehensive of rising prices of inputs in his catering business. While expensive diesel and fertilizer have become a headache for small businessmen in the hinterland. So, it will be quite unlikely that the government leaves something directly in our hands in the upcoming budget, but it can definitely take steps that can reduce the cost of living.